you can keep it outside to stop the clock to get a big play outside. That's a gift from the football guys. 40 yards. And here is Stafford's pass, and Calvin Johnson stopped at the one yard line. The Detroit Lions, no timeouts left. Time is running. They're at the one, and Stafford says, Come on in. Reaches over. Touchdown. Lions lost a heartbreaker last week. Big pass to Durham to Calvin Johnson. And if you're the Cowboys, how do you let this happen? Well, they've got to review it, obviously. It is a scoring play, but I tell you what, some key decisions here. And again, you knew it had to be Calvin Johnson to kind of get the thing started. Now they're going to come back and make sure Calvin Johnson doesn't get involved. Great, great play right here to bring it down to the one yard line. And then smart move by Stafford. Knowing you were thinking, we're going to clock it, we're going to clock it. That's what Dallas thought. You could see there was no push by the defensive line. They thought it was just going to clock it because of the time. That post game news conference I was talking about. Yeah, right. The demeanor just changed a little bit. All those cameras that were in the Dallas locker <laughs> in the media room, that all just went to Detroit. 12 come from behind victories. He's calling clock, but he's got some kind of verbiage or something to tell that offensive line. Or he just did it on his own. I'm watching the yeah. offensive line of the Detroit Lions. They had no idea Matthew Stafford was doing that. Yeah. I'm telling you right now, that's just balling out by a Matthew Stafford just being a heady quarterback. And what does this mean? Going against the team he loved as a youth from Highland Park, suburb of Dallas, Matthew Stafford. That's Once again, coming back and leading what would be a victory over the Dallas Cowboys. That 623 yards looks a whole lot better right now. <laughs> You're about to walk in there and say, well, forget the yardage. I don't care about it if it's a loss. Right now, you can see Jason Witten and Des Bryant. Des Bryant pulling his spoiled child routine again. And don't forget, he said one in 55 for teams that were minus four turnovers since 2011. Two and 54 may be the number here. As the scoring review continues, you'll hear the roar. You'll hear the roar. That is an unbelievable heady play by Matthew Stafford. Calling clock, clock, clock. The offensive line didn't budge. The Cowboys thought it was done. He's figuring, what the heck? I'll take a shot.